I'm delighted to be able to showcase boarding at Felston in 2020. Although it's a strange time, we've worked hard to make sure that boarding is safe, fun and enjoyable for all of our students. <laughs> Myself and Kaylin looked after the students over the Easter holidays during lockdown and we are now back in Follyfield looking after the boarders who have returned um, for some more lockdown boarding. We followed closely the guidance given by the government as we worked to make sure the environment is a safe one for every student. With temperature checks, regular hand cleaning, washing, cleaning, deep cleans of boarding houses and much more besides. My name is Sally Staines and I'm the lead school nurse here at Felsted School. I'm one of a team of eight other nurses and we're here 24 hours a day to look after all the pupils and staff within the school. Testing within the um, UK at the moment has really come on. Um, we can now get the, your child tested if they've got any symptoms within 24, 48 hours and the results are back again within 24, 48 hours, which is a great improvement. Um, and then that will mean if they test negative, they can go straight back into school. So when the international students come back in mid-August, um, currently they will be having a two-week quarantine. Again, of course that may change with um, government guidelines, we just, we're just keeping up to date all the time. Um, if that's the case, then they would just have to stay within the boarding houses that are allocated um, for that purpose. Um, if they're unwell, then we are here 24 hours a day to look after them and get them tested if necessary. When we had the students here at Easter, and obviously the students that we've got with us at the moment, it's really important to try and make any experience that they do have here very positive. And hopefully, with what we put in place, we're trying to make a difference as they're continuing their educational journey with us until the end of term, but hopefully to produce long-lasting impact on their education and their experience of school. My highlight of boarding this week has definitely been being able to see my friends, not being able to see them for a long period of lockdown and being able to see them now and play activities with them, do evening things with them, even do some work with them has really been a highlight. My favourite thing about boarding this week has definitely been being able to go outside and play sports with all my friends and definitely having access to the Hockey Astro where I've been able to do a one-on-one -on -one with my hockey coach and catch up on the three months of hockey coaching that I've missed. I've not been that worried about uh, any of the health risks. I've made sure I've followed all the protocols and uh, it's been very safe for everyone here, so it's been good. Fortunately, especially the location of the school, it's in a very rural area. We're located in the countryside, so there's a good chance, that, um, good chance for us to be able to go outside, not really see anyone else, stay within our bubble, so we're not at any real risk from or any danger from anyone else within the country. So at first I was a bit concerned because I didn't know what would be in, put in place for like social distance, distancing, but um, after being here the first day, like our temperature was taken, which was really like helpful and like re reassuring because I would know that everyone here is healthy and safe. And we also had the nurse who would come in and we have so many um, like teachers and staff who we can go to um, if we need any help. Due to coronavirus, many of us full boarders at Felsted School were unable to get back home after the school shut down. Luckily, Felsted allowed all of us who couldn't journey to stay in Follyfield House for the time being. As a whole, I would like to thank Felsted and mostly the staff members who made this potentially distressing time as smooth and joyful as it was. I am really glad that I actually spent um, most of my lockdown in school in Felsted because here in Italy it, the situation was so much worse and I would have never had such a great time like I had uh, in Felsted. I had to stay at Follies a couple weeks due to coronavirus and at first I was really nervous because I didn't really know any of the people that were also staying behind. Um, however it turned into a really good experience and one of the highlights of my time at Felsted. During this time, what really impressed me the most is it is really, really safe to be as posted and it is one of my best experiences in my life. And so, thank you so much, Posted. 
So looking ahead to the start of term in September, as you can see from our um, experience at Easter, as you can see from the experience that we're putting on for our pupils at the moment, we will be able to adapt to any of the guidelines that can put in place. And if that means a time of isolation or quarantine from arriving into the UK, that is something that we're able to do and we're able to put on for our students. And then hopefully looking ahead until September, we can open the boarding houses and welcome our students back to campus. For any parents who are worried about their children coming to board and coming over to England, please be rest assured that they will be safe with us. They will have a good time. They will feel surrounded by love and care from the students and staff alike. And we are always here to be in contact with you to reassure you that they are happy with us over here. I'm really proud and really privileged to have worked with the students that we've had stay with us at Easter and throughout this period at the end of term. The students are really flexible and they always come up with new ideas about how we can make the programme even more exciting than it already is. And it's really important to try and make memories that will last a lifetime and that can nurture them and develop them in the years to come. Of course, our plans at Felstead will remain flexible according to the needs of the situation. We'll remain open over half term if required. We stay open at Exiax to make sure we can look after borders. And we'll adapt our plans to make sure they work the best they can for every child and every family. We are really looking forward to welcoming our students back in September.